What's up, family? This is your man, not your boy. Go black to Africa. All right, so we are here checking out tractors. And I am here with my brother. Here is a salesman right here. Please introduce yourself. My name is Eric Sonarowa, coming from Khan Equipment Unlimited. Yes, we have a big machine here called Puma, 2925 horsepower. Big machine, big tractor. For you, man, you can come and join us. Yes, this is a um, with the cabin, with a special cabin inside the air condition. If you want to get a suit, jacket, whatever, you can get inside and a farm and come out as you are. Uh, with a radio inside, just a very comfortable chair, a seat where you can see two seats one for operator, one for supervisor. GPS, nice. the machine is good. Cool, big hose, big machine, big car. So this is different than the one that we just saw. This has air conditioner, radio, GPS, yes. two seats, for, uh, one for the driver, one maybe for the supervisor. Yes. And uh, this is a big machine. Now, how much coverage of land uh, can this handle? Oh, this we are talking about a thousand acres. Thousand acres? Yes. Okay. It's a big machine, yeah. And how long can it run in a day? Um, for the case machine, it catches us 24 hours. It runs 24 hours? Yes. Okay. Just about enough operators who can operate this machine. Maybe three because I put in the law of the uh, working. We work, people are working for eight hours. So we need to get three operators. Yes. Yes, so they can, uh, can like a shift or rotate. Okay, so what I'm, what I'm talking is that uh, within that eight hours, how many acres can it go cover? So it depends on uh, two things. It depends on uh, what you put at uh, the back implements. Oh, okay. What, what the arrow, yeah. the side of arrow going to put it. Okay. Yes. It doesn't depend on, the, on the, what we get on the, on the back because it's going to pull even 10 meters uh, arrow. Okay. At the back, yeah. Okay. Uh, so the, 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 the big we have at the back, the, the, the time we're going to get uh, a lot of acres at a time, short time. Okay, so 225 horsepower. Yes. This is a case uh, Puma, yes. and this right here is an American brand. Yes, case is American brand. It's American brand, okay. All right. And uh, it, what's the warranties on the uh, the motor and all that there? The motor will do one thousand uh, warranty, one thousand hours or a year. One year or one thousand hours? Oh, yes. One thousand hours, yes. okay. All right. And so let's walk around here because yeah. uh, this is a big old machine here, and this is for the people who's trying to do a lot of acreage and yeah. stuff. And uh, what is this right here on front? What this is, is this? A, this is a counterweight. This will help us to, to stabilize the machine because if you put an um, implement in the back, you know, to have a weight, the pulling. Oh, this okay. Help to pull the machine down so it can help you to pull uh, your implement at the back. Okay. Yes. And that's a weight stabilizer? Yes, weight stabilizer. This nice. One kilogram. Okay. All righty. Yeah. And, um, the uh, so the warranty on the engine and everything is one year or one thousand uh, hours yes. that are on here. Yes. And uh, let's keep continuing to walk around here. And uh, what about the mechanics of it? I mean, is there any warranty like on the air conditioner? That's is that part of the motor and all that right there? Yeah, we do everything on the time. If you have an air problem, you can see. If it's a factory problem, we can we can uh, give a warranty. Okay. If it's now, a man problem, we say this we can do on your on cost. What is the uh, service? Uh, services uh, requirements on these right here. How often should you change the oil? Um? Always the same, 250 hours. We have to go and through and change the oil, change the filters. Yeah. Then we go through. Otherwise, we can boil the, uh, take off the, the dust, whatever. Yeah. Nice. Okay. Yeah. So I'm going to continue walk around here. And we'll go ahead on the other side. I'm going to go hop up inside of the uh, cabin. All right, let me hop up in here real quick so you all can take a look on the inside of this luxurious farm equipment here that we have. As you can see, we got the nice seats, the speakers up here, air conditioner, you get the control. It's nice. Sit here at the, uh, these are the controls. Oh, okay, we got, we got, we got some uh, air shocks on the seats. And you got the controls. Nice. Okay. 
This is a whole lot of um, machinery. So you got your, your fuel and your temperature gauges. You got your wind, your windshield wiper. So this is it right here. Nice. I like this 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 uh, air shocks uh, seats because I know it's on the hard terrain. Try to take a beating. All right. So let me get down here and ask you a few more questions right here. My brother? Yes. So, okay. What other information do people, uh, people who are reaching out to me who are interested in agriculture? Yes. Um, so, as far as this, the bigger engine is when you have more land that you have to deal with. Yes. Because, of course, the bigger the engine, you know, it's able to last longer. It's less strain on the engine and all that right there. Um, I guess being that this is a GPS, I mean, how does that work with the GPS? Do you know? Uh, not much, but uh, you know, big farms normally we have uh, you set up on a system mm -hmm. so that it can help us to plant properly, mm -hmm. also to make a fertilizer properly because we have uh, pins on GPS we are going to plant. You can set on a farm, so this can follow the same way to avoid disturbing the uh, crops. You know, when you, you drive on the farm, already planted, so yeah. you need to go through the place where you're not, uh, uh, mm -hmm. to avoid to, to kill the, or to, 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 to drive on top of the, of the crops. Okay, yeah. okay. Yeah. And um, as far as the, um, this, this big machinery right here, the, um, I tell you, how much does this thing weigh? <laughs> the do, you know the, do you know the weight? Ah, uh, the weight? Uh, no, but okay, 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 we can see on the spec. Anyway, if you if you check on the spec, you can see it from the website. You can, mm -hmm. uh, if you, you Google 225 uh, Puma horsepower case, you can get the spec sheet. Okay. You can see the the weight of it. Okay. What type of fuel does this take? All this petrol. Petrol, yeah. not diesel. Not diesel. Okay, yeah. petrol. Okay. Now the big question that many people are going to be interested in yeah. is. How much does this machinery cost? The this, price? Yes, the price of this tractor. The price is 108,000 USD. 108,000 or yeah. 180,000? This is American. This is US. Uh, 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 is it one? Yeah. 180. Oh, okay. Comma, okay. Two, 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 two. Gotcha. We got to make sure of that because there's a difference between a 108 and a 180. Uh, yeah. Yes. So this big machine right here is $180,000. Okay. And uh, it comes with all the bells and the whistles. It comes with the uh, air conditioner, the radio, the GPS, two-seater. It has all that right there that's equipped with it for you guys and gals out there who wants to do those thousand acres of, of farming. This right here is for you. Okay, family. So is there anything else? What is your name again? My name is Ed Sonalogua. Ed. Edson. No, Edson. No, no. Okay, yeah. we want to make sure we get your name correctly. And uh, Edson, uh, is there a phone number they can reach you at? Uh, and I could put it into the description. Is there a phone number that you have that they can reach you on? Yes, uh, yes. Plus 255-754-388-8456. All righty. And do you all have an email? Yep. What is your email? Email, email is E-D-S-O-N-N. -N at canoeequipment.com. All right, and as y'all see right here, this is the company, uh, Canoe Equipment, that they have here, this company for you all. I'm doing it for y'all for, hey, bring y'all business here to Africa, Tanzania, and y'all can get those who are interested in agriculture that have been reaching out to me. This right here is the place and the man you can speak to, and uh, as well as uh, uh, Chua, who I spoke to yesterday about the excavator. But we appreciate you. Thank That's you very it. much. Okay, all right, family. You can go on the web and see kind of equipment. You can get all kind of equipment in Africa, to Tanzania. Then you can drop the inquiry. What's the What's the web website? We have website. Just type www. Uh, kind of equipment. Kanu Equipment. Yes. www. Kanu Equipment. We are in 16 countries in Africa, so you can find Tanzania. Drop the inquiry. Will you Will you find it? All righty. You've heard it, family. All right, on to the next.